Hello everybody, Jet here, and welcome back to my uh, Archeon the Ever Chosen, my Hammer Time playthrough, where we are going to try and get hold of uh, Harold Hammerstorm? Harry the Hammer, as CA have dubbed him, and uh, well this time we're on our way, hopefully we'll start the quest line for him today, and we are, well, We've got the Ever Chosen going up against Boris here, and we're doing a, a bit of bear baiting today. I'm, I'm gonna be all about the really bad pun, puns today, guys. All the bad puns. Oh, he's coming straight at me. Ooh, okay. Oh, I was hoping for a choke point. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, I guess we're fighting it. We will, uh, Archeon versus Boris. I mean, Archeon, Archeon, Archeon. Mr. Everchosen is, uh, fairly tough. The bears. The bears of a scary bit here. And, I mean, they're not bad. These guys are fairly trash. The cavalry is annoying. They have a lot of cavalry, though, but it's light cavalry. The issue is, they have range. I don't. Otherwise, I'd just turtle. Channel myself a bit more magic. I mean, I guess I can kind of force them to attack me a bit, but I want to be very careful with it all. Shoot the bears! Okay, we're going to pull straight back. Go! Pin them, kill them. Spread corruption where chaos commands. Give no In we go. to help support against the bears. Start folding right around the back there. All you guys in, 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 in. Sorry, I completely forgot about my cavalry there for a minute. Like some sort of noob. Spirit Leech Boris into the back of them. Good, we're doing a good job over here. Running. 
you out into them, stop them shooting. Right, disengage these guys. These guys need to be kept moving. Okay, get the doggies around the back. I don't really care if they die because there are any doggies, but I want to keep them the enemy busy if you see what I mean. Oh god, my um, cavalry is getting kind of shredded. the bears thing is even if I lose this I can re-recruit relatively quickly and actually uh, taking out their units they have fairly irreplaceable units there in this army so even if I don't come out completely on top it's not the end of the world Oh, a poor unit. <laughs> I say that poor unit. I obviously don't care. And the boss man is fighting their boss man on a bear. Oh, he is actually on a bear now. We flee! Deliver slaughter! There we go. Give us Oh. Let's try and take those bears out early. Eh, he's about to run away. Shows how brave these men of Kislev actually are. Saved up for a soul leech while he was running. Come on, one good hit. Yes! We've we've won it. It's over. They they're they're gonna break any second now. Do not let the bears escape. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, they're going to escape. But good, good. We changed it from a valiant defeat to a victory. So, yeah, I'm happy with that. Though we took a lot of losses. Those Zargard. Zargard are just terrifying. Sorry if you can hear me drinking tea. The Zargard and their bears did spectacularly, but they're now gone. And that is the thing about them, is they did spectacularly, but they are now gone. And they'll be more than gone next turn. What are you doing in my territory? Unless you want to be my vassal, get out of my territory. Extra tribute. Yeah. 
No more bears. Nice, giving ourselves a brand new vassal there as well. Right, so let's have a look at it. How do I actually... I up this through tech. So actually I want to do Slanesh. Early. Because... Yeah. We want to gain some Slanesh authority because I think that gives us access to their units, maybe? Yeah. I'm probably completely wrong and some of you are probably swearing at me in the comments, but you know. Uh, let's start actually buffing up because this is fantastic. All non-demonic infantry, you know. Excellent. Eleven still. I thought we leveled up. <laughs> no. I don't know if he's a faction I can actually vassalize. There are some you can't, and it would be annoying if I could, because it would be so cool to corrupt him. Corrupt him and turn him into a de into, into one of my uh, demon princes, which I can't do, definitely can't do. But Bellicor can do that, but I don't think he can do it to legendary lords. I mean, we're going for the defense ones, as we discussed earlier, because they are OP. So I can't side grade them. Ah, requires technology, uh, sensorous branding. There we go. Ah, okay. So I've basically got to get to those techs. And because we're undivided, we're going to pick the best. So my front line is going to be Slaneshi, because uh, of that defense. We're obviously going to have pink horrors behind from Siege, because... Because... Who doesn't like a good evil ranged setup? Yeah, of course I'll trade with you. No, we're doing fine on them at the moment. Oh, whoops, why did I keep it? Derp, 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 derp. Straight to business. Where shall we raid next? The longships are ready. Understood. Here we go. All sorted now. You dare what? Now the end time has come. The reason I'm doing this is boss man already seemed tough enough in a fight, so I don't feel the need to do any of that yet. What level do I actually get access to this? Hmm. Oh, I can't tell because I literally don't have any points. There we go. And I think some are probably better for, you know, my anti-large. But I don't think my front line really needs anti-large. <laughs> no. You're sitting on a dark citadel. You think I'm going to leave you there? Oh? 
I need to do some of these battles, but I'm in no rush to do them. No, I'm not going to start another war just yet. The only issue with Chaos Warriors is they are slower. These guys don't have bad melee attack either. They just feel particularly junk, can I be honest? Junk is a technical term, please don't use it. Hmm. Now, let's get ourselves some mages. And more income. I mean, you... It, it, it's such a weird thing. I love the way the army's upgraded. And there is a mod which allows the warbound system for every faction, which I think is really cool. I actually think it's a really, really cool and interesting way of having factions level up, um, which I think they should definitely do more of. If I'm honest, I think it should be, you know, much more. I think you should be able to recruit things, but it should take much longer, whereas the main way should be upgrading people. doing well enough to actually do oh, so I want that but I'm only gaining 50 a turn eh. for now probably get better uh, defenses and Karak dumb, but we'll see. Still surprises me a bit which places are and which places aren't um, sometimes um, citadels, dark citadels. Big cities of chaosness, ness, 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 ness. I probably want to push towards each of them. Yeah, we want to do Siege as well, because I want to start getting Siege and Demons. <laughs> Through my gifts. Probably unlock some of these, shouldn't I? Right. <laughs> Here we go. Do you think we're a little more, um, Slaneshi here, guys? <laughs> but, I mean, even compared to that, they're just good. The weapon strength is a bit lower. But they're just solid. Their defensiveness is just massive, comparatively. And that's the thing I'm after here for these guys at the moment.
Let's have a look at cavalry. So that's what I like from cavalry. Let's have a look at the Slaneshi variant. Uh, C52. 61. Melee defense is what I like from cavalry. 57. So I probably want the Tsitian cavalry, and I do get access to Doom Knights. But Doom Knights are a bit meh, if I'm brutally honest. Oh, no, I do get Skull Crushers of Corn, though, which are spectacularly fun. So actually, yeah, I probably want to do Corn Knight cavalry. Uh, they still got reasonable melee defense, and they are great fun. Um, there'll be something I want from Nurgle, maybe? I mean, their great weapons are spectacular, but yeah. But the thing I mostly want from Siege are the uh, demons. So, yeah. Uh, I want the um, the pink horrors, the exalted pink horrors. Ooh, okay, we may um. See fact, no, 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 no. Ah. Yeah, we're gonna lay siege them. I was hoping. Oh, look at that cavalry they've got again. Oh, let's just grab that to keep pushing it up. I was very much hoping to be able to cheese them outside, force them out. What do you want? Not a cat in hell. You can bend the knee or get out of my land. I'm going to auto it because it means I can just walk into the settlement next turn, guys. <gasps> yes! I can subjugate Boris! <laughs> I have bears! Or I will have bears. Oh, that's nice, actually. I have pet Kislevites, guys. <laughs> Oh, that's cool. Hmm. Interesting. There doesn't seem to be one here which buffs. Arranged, but you know. Yeah, I think melee defense as well there is really Help. solid. And now I don't care. Ah, the slaughter begins. Oh, 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 oh. New gifts. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of Bulwark. Uh, causing fear. I can't afford anything else. Oh no. I have to wait a turn before I can do anything else. Oh, that's annoying. I know exactly what I want. The 100% extra um, income from my vassals. <laughs> Almost all of my income comes from my vassals, I suspect. As it should do. Ooh. 
Yes! Wow, oh, that is beautiful how much cheaper I made that. There we go. This will serve. It is decreed by me. Oh, nice. And that's all gone up by one. Can I flip them back? No, once I've marked them, I can't flip them back, which is a little annoying, but... We are heading towards the Howling Citadel at full speed. My duty. I love the fact I have a Boris. I have a Boris now. If only he looked corrupted. This I take first. <laughs> chaos bear that means I technically now have chaos bears guys just gonna put that out there means I have chaos bears means eventually I will if it's so long as he doesn't get wiped out I will eventually be able to recruit bears I am definitely going to expand his territory Oh, wow. I mean, I'm not going to start messing around. I don't want my income, my cost to go too insane, oh, if I'm honest. So. I could do recruiting some more units, though. These guys. Oh, well, I'm gonna grab them because give me some range. These guys are insane. Do you know? Giving myself some extra fast movers, I think. The storm of chaos gaps. Yeah, I'm aware. Until I've unlocked some of these, I don't care. The issue of souls is obviously maintaining the, uh... No. Maintaining the income. I still want to do a Slaneshi playthrough at some point where I have fun of, by corrupting people, but we'll see. Well, I mean, I've, I've already got a plan for that. Yeah, I know I've unlocked new stuff, but I don't... I'm not going to use them at the moment. You can stop telling me I've unlocked them. Ah! Not you! Not you! God damn! Corson, 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 you did not want to be in the Howling Citadel. I love that you get a noise from this when you're close to it. Has he just run away from the citadel I'm about to take? I believe he has. <laughs> nope. Those chaos dwarves may need um, dealing with sometime soon. Uh, occupy and vassalize. Because I definitely want this place. Here we go. Now the end 
de We'll hit end turn and see what happens. I should have unlocked the mission now, but it may take a turn to unlock. It is new, so it's possible as bugs, but it's definitely all unlocked on my account, so we'll see. Oh, Corson's gone for a play. I mean, he doesn't exactly have much choice. Here we go, the Hammerstorm cometh. Kill 3,000 enemies in battle. Uh, I get 2,000 favor and I unlock him. War, the wars waged by chaos have, uh, the wars waged by chaos have been the most terrible of all conflicts in history. Their destruction unrivaled by anything else. But each war has been but a test, a sham, a preparation for the greater war that is yet to come. Every battle, a touch of the taloned hand of chaos, probing the defences of a mortal world. Soon, the day will come when the chaos musters in its true, horrifying strength. But first, its acolytes must prove their military might with yet more bloodshed. In return, the gods will pave the way to the end by sending forth their first Forgotten champion. Ah, seriously, I guess we're fighting. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't think there's 2,000 of them, but that's not a difficult one to do. Ulrika was a lot of the pain to do, whereas this does not seem that bad. I'm honestly not that well bothered. I mean, the blood letters are annoying, but we're just going to envelop. We have a much bigger force than them. Uh, we're going to have a huge long defensive line, and we are just going to envelop them, I'm going to be honest. Oh, we're going to attempt to envelop them anyway. It's corn. They're gonna come at me. Oh god, I actually want to pull these guys back. I care about this for these units on the front line. That'd be your mistake. <laughs> now you can push through. Start flanky flanking. You guys into there, you guys over here, good. You guys can all get yourselves right behind, we're absolutely shredding them here now. I mean, this was never going to be anything other than a massacre, let's be honest. Ignore those doggies and surround the other doggies. Warriors of 
cause of finesse. Exalted hero. Attack the mortals. Ooh. Okay, get your butt out, actually. Your will? Quickly. For the chaos gods. Deliver slaughter. <laughs> I almost feel bad. It's over. In search of Good. And because they're mostly demons, they will. I don't think any of them will have survived. I mean, some stuff did survive, but yeah, it's uh, we we took a bit more damage than I expected to. I mean, my exalted hero got a bit more battered, but he was fighting Corson himself, so you know. Um, yeah, no, it's, I expected him to do better. Um, yeah, and my Slaneshi front line were just the most defensive things ever. Take the experience this time, because I don't really need anything else, and Coulson is still apparently. Right. Uh, ah, 3,000 enemies, so yeah. We will work on it. But yeah, I'm, I'm quite happy with how it's going. Um. The storm of chaos dance. There we go. Anyway, guys, that is where we're going to leave it for today. So I think we're in a good, solid position. Um, probably going to look at getting myself another army soon, actually. Kind of happy to lay for ch the, the chorfs down here for the time being. Because they do provide a decent buff. Although I'm not going to make the mistake of trusting them. That's why I might might get another army going soon. For now, I think I'm going to keep pushing up up here. We're going to give Bor try and give Boris some more territory along the coastline. Because a strong, a strong uh, Chaos Kislev force, I think, will be quite good for us. Um, but yeah, um, let me know what you think, guys, in the comments, so that you know, me know where you think I should be going. Anyway, as always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you are enjoying this playthrough. Please do like and subscribe if you are. And as always, an extra special thank you to my channel members and patrons. That's Mods Abound, Philip F, Nose Nose, Andrew T, Prataru, Brandon, Space Ace 475, Coding Monster, Jason Air. Egg and Jared Horn, and thank you everyone for watching. Cheers. All.